What's up, my dudes? How's it going today? Dak Blake here. Today, we're looking at Poppy Playtime Chapter 4 stuff. That's right. Today is all about discovering secrets of Poppy Playtime Chapter 4. And you're probably asking yourself, how, Dak Blake? Well, today is another part of the ARG. And so you're probably asking yourself, Dak Blake, what's an ARG? Well, hey, you're, you're asking a lot of questions. <laughs> I'm just kidding. ARG means alternate reality game. Basically, Mob Entertainment, the developer of Poppy Playtime, hid a bunch of secrets inside of the videos they just uploaded. They basically have tasked us with trying to discover those secrets and they hid Poppy Playtime Chapter 4 secrets behind all of these codes. So today we're gonna be looking at the secrets of Chapter 2 and then the, the secrets of Chapter 3. I'm actually recording this video. They sent it to me a little bit early. So I'm gonna be looking at the Chapter 3 one uh, <laughs> before anybody else gets to look at it. So I I wonder if I'll figure it out. But nevertheless, I, I'm really excited. I think this is gonna be really fun. I wanna see if I can discover stuff. You know me, yo boy, Zach Blake. I always find some sort of secret. Let's uh, let's watch these. So this is Poppy Playtime chapter two story so far. Like I said, they sent me the third one. I can't release my video, this video that you're watching until they release their video. So it like, it'll be out for you guys as well, but I'm watching it a little bit early. Um, but let's watch this first one um, right now. Let's Let's just let's see so it is starting like it always does with this random date okay with poppy out of her case she began to guide the intruder so it's gonna go over chapter two right now look for any secrets any codes oh my gosh there's probably already stuff that we missed <laughs> okay when poppy gave them out there was little protest mm-hmm I'd like to pay you back. Man, there's a train station. I always wonder if we should still you trust Poppy. And I haven't. Okay. Why it's so easy. Listen. Uh-huh. I'm going to need you to trust me. That was the craziest scene back the in the day. Followed closely behind. The intruder. Descending into another section of the facility. Mm -hmm. The game station. It was here the intruder met another of Playtime's creations. Mm -hmm. I wonder who's the narrator of this. It almost sounds like the prototype. Mommy long legs. Ooh. In some ways, the game station had been hers. Uh -huh. And so, with two trespassers in her reach, she saw mm -hmm. fit to make a game of Poppy and her friend. Obey the rules, or I'll tear you apart. And eat Man, your this scene was so while good. Still alive. <laughs> First you know, it brings back some nostalgia. A cognitive test. Simple, mm -hmm. but a useful metric for us. I'm trying to keep an open eye to see if I can discover any secrets. Sometimes they're literally just hidden in the backgrounds now. Next was uh -huh. Wacka Wacky. Oh, Primarily this one was so scary. With reaction times. How those small ones always mm. scurry and swamp. The ex-employee made their way to the third and final game, but not before running into a familiar silhouette. Ah, Kissy Missy. This experiment, Kissy Missy, had a calmer, more cautious demeanor. She even helped on Shooter pass through the halls. Because now we know that she was working with Poppy, the right? Last game. Over a dozen legs and a long winding body slinked behind our trespasser. Hmm. When they came face to face, I've already seen one code. Legs, though, I don't know if you guys noticed. There was nothing left but anger. Oh man, this was a, such a good chase scene. Wait, I think I saw another code. Man, they really hit it. Okay, I don't know if you're noticing these. What's left of her is his now. <laughs> oh man. And inside a control room oh what he said is his now station, so the narrator wouldn't reunited with Poppy. wouldn't say that if he was the prototype huh the train. I see three coats on the bottom already right there they entered the completed code and the old engine began to stir huh the path leading out seemed clear and yet hmm. something unforeseen happened you are perfect this is where I'm like, I'm can sorry. we really, really trust Poppy? 
But I guess in her perspective, we were like the perfect person to help. It has long been the custom of those who call this factory home to use others for personal gain, to stab them in the back. Oh. I'm certain it came to Poppy naturally. Oh, okay. So the first thing is, is this this thing starts with a code. Hold on, right, right there. Do you see it? Uh, there, G S Tuz and something else. Uh, hold on, I can get it. I have to pause it perfectly. I can't even pause it in time. Look at how fast. It's not even at like one second in. It's like a half second in. How do I pause? Okay, I had to open it in another program. It is 45, 60, 65, 76, 60. It's just random code. I think that, okay, so I think everybody figured out the chapter two stuff already. I want to see if I can kind of do it, but I kind of almost want to just speed ahead to chapter three. I want to discover stuff that nobody's discovered yet. Um, I think this looks... Like hexadecimal, maybe. Huh? And you're probably like, Dag Blake, what, what is, what is that? <laughs> it is a code deciphering system. Let me see. So this is like a hexadecimal code right here. It's like numbers and sometimes letters, and it translates into text. So let me see. So when you put it in, it says eleven words. Good luck. And wait, we did figure out kind of like a starting thing before. The last time we did this, it was like sleep draws ever near or something like that. Now, like we saw before, if I I try to pause it just at the beginning you'll see ah oh man it's so difficult it's g-s-t-u-z this is another code i think it's different i'm not sure what this one is actually and i think throughout the course of the video i saw a bunch of those but they were like not just on the screen they were like built in like for example, this one, I see PWFS that was down there. It was on the bricks. And then I think as the game goes for forward, I feel like, hold on. There was some on the walls in the background right there. H M Y H P K. I feel like this one is very complicated. Honestly, now that I'm seeing how complicated this is, I almost kind of want to see what people have discovered so we can just start on the third chapter. What would you even think all those random letters would mean? Okay, I just went to the YouTube video and it is complicated look at this it says to all who are struggling and curious to find about the hidden messages here it is firstly there's a super fast flash okay we discovered that right now oh all of these numbers all right which translated into a hexadecimal decoder says 11 words good luck i don't know what that means oh my gosh they figured out every single time code the first one we saw was gs tuz am not see how do you see how complicated this is i don't know if you have, if you came into this video like chapter four yeah right look at how complicated they they literally de like encrypted the the secrets behind code literally so the first one apparently are is a is a hexadecimal code then they go into a caesar cipher whatever that means so it's am not and then it turns into paths turning of death but i over afraid clear that makes no sense says the arranged complete sentence says over paths turning clear but i am not afraid of death oh it says now if we combine the two messages on the first chapter and the second chapter we get uh this oh it's like a poem on felted feet with bated breath sleep draws ever near over paths turning clear but i am not afraid of death okay you know, I don't, <laughs> I don't like the rhyming pattern of A, B, B, A. I feel like it sounds weird. It feels like it should be like rhyme, uh, rhyme, or like rhyme, not rhyme, rhyme, uh, rhyme. Okay, that makes no sense, but you, you get what I mean if you if you read poems. But what does this mean? So on felted feet with bated breath, that sleep draws ever near. That's definitely catnap. Over paths turning clear, but I am not afraid of death. Over paths turning clear. Is that ice? Is that water that turns into ice turning clear? Or is that... Hmm. So you could see this is all so complicated. We just got part of a poem. I think we we can't really make sense of that poem until we see the chapter three one, which nobody has figured out because I have it early right now. Let's just watch it. It's not early as you're watching this video. It's probably maybe already figured out as well. But hey, maybe I figured it out in this episode. Let's see. All right, here we go. Like the I'm chapter so three one. I am excited. Zero, okay. One, two, so. so seven. Reversal. Oh man, I don't even know if I missed anything zone. yet. Even dazed, I'm sure they must remember it all quite clearly. Okay. Experiment 1188. 1188. Catnap. This guy. With nowhere else to go, uh -huh. and seemingly no one. I think I just saw a code right there on the floor. Only oh no. Onward. This is where they hmm. encountered a most infuriating ally. Hey, hey. Infuriating ally. 
Keep your eyes open. Nice to meet you. After a short okay. pass through the train station, our uninvited guests began their descent to Playcare, Playtime Co.'s own on-site orphanage, okay. and Elliot's grand beacon of hope. Mm. Below, they received a key from their newfound ally, one that led directly to the still-beating heart of Playcare. Mm. Okay. The red smoke. To our guest, not all was told. But to leave, they Wait, had to redirect the gas. Not all was told. All that seemed left was the push of a button. Hmm. Oh no! Someone killed the power. Find the building's backup generator. Good luck. Hmm. Okay. The home sweet home. One. Who is this narrator? Was the of this place. Okay. At night, it was his red smoke that lulled the many children into slumber. But okay. now it had become a nightmare. Oh. Trust is a funny thing. Hmm. It can often be earned or broken in but an instant. But what we make of those who've broken that trust is a very individual viewpoint. Hmm. Well, there we got Kissy Missy again. Listen, I'm not your enemy, but I can't just let you leave. Okay. I need you, so we can get revenge on those monsters who've tortured you, who've tortured us. See, is she using us still? I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I do trust her, though. <laughs> the finish line. I'm sure that's how it must have felt. Oh, man. Here he comes. I feel like I haven't seen any the secrets in a, in a while. Each wants to believe in its own sense of significance. Hmm. Many live their whole life in ignorance of the truth. That's really their weak. But in a corner, sometimes we reveal ourselves as something more. And our intruder, there's something special indeed. Hmm. Which inevitably brings everything back to our dear old Poppy. Okay. And with her was the truth. You came back because of your code. Ah, the hour of this joy. This is your answer. We called it the hour of joy. The guilty. The There's innocent. Huggy Wuggy. Didn't matter. The experiments killed everyone. Crazy. As soon as we reach the bottom, we'll send the lift back up. Just hold tight, okay? All right. Oh, we man, what happens to Kissy Missy? No, no, no! Which brings us to now. Now! Doesn't this is where we are! My voice is cracking! Wait! I just saw binary code time. right there. Wait, what? <laughs> Next outbound transmission, September 30th? What? Okay. Uh, this was so cool. Um, I, I wonder if I can figure anything out. Can I pause it in any way? I'm trying to like pause it to make sure I don't miss anything. Am I missing anything? <laughs> I thought I saw writing on the wall over here. It just says run. What if they don't hide any codes? I feel like that's what they just did for the last one, right? But maybe they need more of the poem though. I'm trying right now to watch the whole video in like slow motion. It's kind of agonizing because you don't, I don't even know what I don't know right now. I don't even know <laughs> what could possibly be even here, you know? I thought I kind of had something in the beginning, but I guess the word scratched on the wall run gave me a sense that there was going to be codes written around, but I don't, I don't see any. Considering that they did the codes um, in the chapter two video, not just like on screen, it wasn't like a video effect. It was literally built into the game. I'm wondering if I'm missing things that are like clear. So I think the only really code that I know that I saw was at the very end, that. Okay, well, <laughs> I'm gonna have to type all of this out, aren't I? One, 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 zero. 
one 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 zero one 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 zero one 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 okay i'm gonna go insane all right it has been quite a while i'm still i'm i'm wondering if i messed up one of the zeros or one of the ones if i do it messes up the whole thing this is way too long. Okay, it took me so long and I finally typed it all out. If I messed up one of the ones or one of the zeros, I feel like it's done, no? All right, I must have done something wrong. This, this is what came out. <laughs> All right, I'm back to the, oh, okay, wait, 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 hold on. I'm back to the video. Look at how fast that goes. I think there's another line of uh, binary code that we haven't put in. Hold on, there's that one right there. What's that? Okay, I'm gonna copy that and see if I can figure something out. I've went to so many websites trying to figure out what I am doing and I, I don't know. What is this? It gave me a bunch of numbers. All right, I've been sitting in silence for like the past, I don't even know how long. And um, it, it doesn't make any sense. See, this is the complicated thing that it feels like people who know how to do like ciphers and codes, they figure out so fast. I've been recording this for so long. I've literally just probably been sitting here in silence. It's probably not even a long video. Man, and that's the only code I can see. What is this? Okay, so I've been reading in kind of like the YouTube Discord that we have, and people are saying that maybe you have to convert it to an image. So I'm just gonna put my whole list that I have here into um, here and just draw it. I th no way it's a QR code it is a QR code oh my gosh it is so small I gotta scan it I gotta scan it okay I scanned it and it says in backwards letters that hey I, like I don't even know if you can see this uh not really <laughs> I'm all trying to see it says this but I can see that with this capital F it says for for we have all already met I think that's the last line. So this is it. On felted feet and with bated breath, sleep draws ever near, overpass turning clear, but I am not afraid of death for we have already met. Is that the prototype? I mean, the only people that we have met that have still stuck around are the prototype, Poppy and Kissy Missy, but it's clearly the prototype, right? Or is it Huggy Wuggy? I am not afraid of death for we have already met. Oh. So I think with that, we have discovered kind of the last secret, but the thing is now, is now we have to kind of interpret what that means for chapter four. Does that mean, like, I mean, maybe that's Huggy Wucky coming back. Is that confirmed? I don't know. You know, technically we haven't really met the prototype, right? We have, we, it's not gonna be Poppy and it's not gonna be Kissy Missy. The only person we've met is Huggy Wuggy who has felt feet. I don't know, maybe I'm crazy, but I feel like maybe that confirms that Huggy Wuggy will be back. Oh man, this is so cool. I mean, what do you guys think? Maybe you guys have a different interpretation. We are seeing so many secrets. I have recorded for almost an hour. This video is probably not even that long. I've just been literally sitting here typing in numbers. I literally <laughs> typed out all of a binary code into a notepad to try to translate it. And I didn't even think about putting all of that code and putting it into an image. That is crazy, but I think that might be it. It seems like from the chapter two episode, the only thing that came out of it was just pieces of a poem. So I guess we just have, we have the full poem now. Well, with that, I think I'm gonna leave it there. Hopefully September 30th has something pretty cool. It says that's the next outbound transmission. But uh, hopefully you enjoyed, hopefully I made you smile. You got to see me go crazy into the deciphering. <laughs> but uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing as we get closer and closer to 3 million subscribers. It is crazy. It is blowing my mind. I thank God every day I'm able to do things like this and I hope to make you smile in every episode. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, peace out, my dudes.